like we're getting a call for a fire alarm and a dwelling. We'll go ahead, head to the scene, see what's going on. I'm going to take uh, 32 over there. So we'll be doing a lot of firefighting videos. I figured we could take another look at Emerge NYC. I try to watch a few videos about how to play the game. It still is fairly confusing and complex game, but I feel like I'm trying a little better to uh, do a good job at actually playing it. Um, you do learn quite a bit about how host connections are made and um, scene management. New update to the game. What is she doing? New update to the game includes... Um, It includes AI management, so AI can now get to the scene and respond on their own. So I'm probably gonna do that. Um, let's go ahead and open this menu real quick. So by hitting F2, we can send another unit there. Uh, so our red is our ladder, so we probably need a ladder there. All right, we're sending some of the units there. Now, I think I figured it out. I think you have to hit this kind of downloading looking option. So they're headed to the scene now. We were in 32. We're actually gonna spawn into a unit a little bit closer to the scene. This way we can get there. And once we get there, I believe we can call other units. We'll see how it goes. We're gonna go into oncoming traffic. Traffic's actually turned off in the game at the moment. Should pretty much be a straight shot and then I'll start getting AI there. This is a ladder. I believe it's an apartment building on fire. Alright, it appears we're on scene here, and I'm not seeing too much. I even zoomed out. The call was for... a child caller reporting fire. So it could be a false call. I'm gonna do a, a quick lap around the building. We're actually gonna turn around. And uh, if it's a false, we'll go ahead, clear it. We won't call any more units. But I am not seeing anything here. Can we cut through this alley? This clipping is terrible. Yep, to me this looks like a false alarm. So we'll go ahead and clear this call. All right, we're getting reports of a fire in a transit trash bin in the station. So we're gonna head to that scene. You can see it on the map. So we're actually gonna go to a unit that's a little bit closer to the scene. Let's see, we pull up our map. Incidents right there. Okay, looks like rescue nine is gonna be our closest unit. So we'll use Rescue 9 to get to the scene, then we'll use the AI, which is a newer update, to get uh, everyone else there. So let's go ahead, gear up.
Should be right up ahead. Now, I actually think this is underground. So you can see there it looks, appears to be a subway entrance over there. So we're just going to park up right here. And then we're going to use AI. Let's get a uh, engine over here on scene. So uh, if we do 32. By clicking this area, we should be able to get them to uh, respond here to the scene. All right. So uh, sometimes getting units to respond to the scene with the AI is a little bit glitchy. Sometimes they actually run into you and things like that. Uh, let's see what equipment we have. Sounds like a trash fire. So if we can get a fire extinguisher down there, I think we might be able to handle it. All right, let's see what we got down here. Oh yeah. Uh, let's get a hood on. And let's try to put this bad boy out. I think we have to get right up on it. This thing was definitely on fire. And it's possible that uh, because of the situation that it was not even going to allow us to call additional AI because it was something just one unit can handle. I don't know exactly how it works. All right. Uh, that fire seems to be put out from what I can see. It's just a trash fire. So uh, we'll head back up. We can go ahead and take off our hood. And uh, we'll put up this equipment and head back to the station for another call. Got a vehicle on fire. We're going to go ahead and respond to this one. Let's see if we got uh, anybody a little closer. It's right there. Rescue 9. Yeah, actually, we should be able to go here and take a straight shot up FDR Drive. So we'll go ahead and do that. Let's go ahead and gear up. And we're going to head to the scene. Take a left hand turn. These pedestrians are not the smartest. So we should be able to just go straight up the interstate here. Is what I'm hoping. Not sure what side it will be on. Now, if there's not a hydrant nearby, these trucks do have their own water supply. It's a limited. So uh, we'll see if we can handle it. If it's on the interstate, I don't know about the availability of uh, water. I can see the smoke already in the distance. Yeah, it looks like it's on the interstate. Yeah, I don't know that we're going to have access to water up here. All right, 30 is going to be on scene. How about? Okay, so what I think we need to do here, there's our water tank volume. We don't have an inlet connection. Let's turn on our scene lights since it's nighttime. I think I can grab an attack line out of the back. 
and we can pull it back i think there's uh there's a limited amount of hose you can pull i think it's like six links of hose so we're just gonna pull this out a little bit and then we'll go up to it and uh, attach it to the side all right i think that should be okay so we drop the hose there and then we'll disconnect if we run out of water, we'll probably have to get another truck on scene, is my guess. Pull this one and connect it on this side. All right, that's gonna be our discharge. So we'll go back here, grab the other side of it. Still getting a hang of how all the pump connections work. It can get a lot more complicated than this, there's like quick charge lines, there's um, other lines that I'm really not sure how to use at the moment. So we're just gonna put this over here for now. We need to uh, grab our connection, which is in one of these. We do have a fire extinguisher too. Go. Grab this. Put this over here. We'll just drop it. All right, I think we can start pumping. There we go. All right, let's try to put this thing out. Looks like we're gonna run out of water pretty quick. are out of water wonderful all right let's get another unit on scene here let's see if we can do this in the meantime i will grab Our fire extinguisher and we'll see if we can put anything else out and it's just recatching it looks like thought I had one okay I don't have a fire extinguisher Fortunately, there's nobody in here. So to use a deck gun, we're definitely not gonna have any, we don't have any water. We're completely dry at the moment. Let's see, water tank volumes, done. All right, rescue nines here. know what we're gonna be able to do with nine all right let's see what equipment we have I know we have fire extinguishers pretty sure it does not have water tank rescue nine I think just has like all these special tools like jaws of life defibrillator honestly I think we're just gonna have to let this thing burn out because we cannot get water supply up here and even if the ladders get here, they don't have their own water tanks. I think it's only the engines. So this thing, uh, realistically, it probably just let it burn out until it got to uh, a lower level. And then 
Uh, we could put out the fire, whatever remains of it. But that's going to conclude today's video of Emerge NYC. I'm still learning how to play this game. It is fairly complicated. But um, I did want to have another shot of it since we've been doing a lot of firefighting stuff. Thanks for watching. See you on the next episode.